Let's take a look at this problem taken from the IMO long list. Find the power of 2 such that when this power is added by 2 to the power of 8 and 2 to the power of 11, the sum is a perfect square. Before we move on, don't forget to give a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. Noticing that 2 to the power of 8 equals 256, while 2 to the power of 11 is equal to 2048. And if you add them up, the sum is 2304. It is actually 48 squared. So this question is simply asking for you to solve 2 to the power of n equals m squared minus 48 squared. Since the right hand side is the difference of squares, we can factorize and we get m plus 48 times m minus 48. And the product is a part of 2. If the product equals a part of 2, both terms m plus 48 and m minus 48 must be both powers of 2. And so we can let m plus 48 to be say 2 to the power of a while m minus 48 is equal to 2 to the power of b where a b should be integers that is non-negative of course we'll soon find out that if one of them is one then the other cannot be a part of two so actually a and b should be positive integers. Now from this, we can first solve for a and b, because by taking the difference of these two equations, we have 2 to the power of a minus 2 to the power of b equals 96. Of course here we are assuming that b is smaller than a. So we can take out 2 to the power of b as a common factor on the left hand side and we have 2 to the power of b times 2 to the power of a minus b and this power subtracted by 1 the product equals 96. At this point we can see that the expression inside the bracket is odd. So the, the power 2 to the power of b should take up all the factors of 2 and 2 to the power a minus b minus 1 should be the remaining odd factor. So we can deduce that 2 to the power of b has to equal to 32 so that dividing on 96 by 32 we have the remaining odd factor which is 3. So that means b equals 5 and 2 to the power a minus b equals 4 which implies a minus b equals 2 and so we have got a as well and that is 7. Going back to the system above we have m plus 48 to be equal to 2 to the power 7 and m minus 48 equals to 2 to the power 5 and solving that we have m equals either 32 plus 48 or 128 minus 48 which will both give 80 and so checking we actually have n equals 7 plus 5 because a plus b here equals n. So n equals 12 and indeed the first two powers which have some 2304 added by 2 to the power 12 that is 4096 and the sum is 6400 which is indeed 80 squared. So this is valid and this is our final solution.
please feel free to share your ideas in the comments. Thank you for watching. See you next time.